If you were floating in a spaceship, looking out toward the constellation Volpecula, you would see something familiar. A deep, azure, blue marble. A twin. To our own Earth. From a distance, it looks like a haven. A sanctuary of water and sky. It is breathtaking. But in astrophysics, distance is often a deception. Because if you were to descend into those blue clouds, you wouldn't find water. You wouldn't find life. You would find yourself in a world made of nightmares. This is HD 189733b, the planet where it rains glass, sideways. That beautiful blue color doesn't come from oceans. It comes from the atmosphere itself, specifically silicate particles, rock. Imagine a sandstorm on Earth. Now imagine that sand is molten. High in this planet's atmosphere, the heat is so intense that vaporized rock condenses into clouds. But they don't rain water, they rain molten glass. And here is where the true horror begins. On Earth, a Category 5 hurricane produces winds of around 160 miles per hour. That alone can level cities. But on this planet, the wind howls at more than 5,400 miles per hour. That's over seven times the speed of sound. If you were caught in this storm, the glass wouldn't fall gently from above. It would be driven sideways, like a shotgun blast. Each shard slicing horizontally through the atmosphere, faster than a bullet. A planet-sized sand blaster, a world of supersonic glass storms. But somehow, this still isn't the strangest thing about HD. 189733. B. The real mystery is why it exists at all. By every rule, we learn from our own solar system. This planet should not exist. In our cosmic neighborhood, gas giants like Jupiter and Saturn live far from the sun, in the deep cold. They are the shepherds of the outer dark. But HD 189733b defies that pattern. It orbits its parent star so closely that a single year lasts just two Earth days. The planet is tidally locked, just like the moon always shows the same face to Earth, HD 189733b is forced to stare into the fire of its star forever. One side is trapped in an eternal blistering day, the other in endless night. Logic says the night side should be frozen solid, but it isn't. And this brings us to something truly humbling, those supersonic winds aren't just storms, they form a planetary conveyor belt. They tear heat away from the day side and hurl it across the planet, blasting it into the darkness. There is no cool refuge, no calm hemisphere. The entire world becomes a single circulating furnace. Day and night blur together into a uniform oven of destruction. And here's the unsettling part. We still don't fully understand how an atmosphere like this can survive at all. So close to its star, the radiation should strip it away, blow it into space, leave behind a naked core, and yet the atmosphere remains violent, massive, and lethal. When we look up at the night sky, we often search for a twin, a mirror of our own home. We see a blue dot, and our hearts leap with hope. But the universe is not obligated to resemble us. It is vast, violent, and unimaginably creative in its destruction. HD 189733b is a reminder that beauty can be a mask, a jewel that warns us what looks like home from a distance may be the most hostile place in the galaxy. And if this is the kind of universe you want to explore, the beautiful, the violent, and the impossible, you're in the right place.